Who here is actually from Connecticut originally? Most of us. New England? Who here is from New a different part of the country? So, where are you guys from? I'm from New York. New York's so the Northeast still? Minnesota. Oh, nice. And? Maryland. Maryland? Ohio. Ohio. So we have a, a, a mix. Most of us are from the Northeast. <coughs> Some of us are from the upper Midwest and the Midwest. And you know, Maryland, which is a beautiful state. But we've lost 14 million acres in this country of prime farmland. Not just soil, the most productive soil in the world. You can put under asphalt roofs, asphalt driveways, and concrete. Okay? That's four and two thirds the size of the state of Connecticut. Okay? 14 million acres impervious surface in the housing boom that ended a few years ago, almost 10 years ago now, show my age. So, why do we care, right? Who cares, we've got technology. We've got technology, we can grow anything we want. 2012, it stopped raining. Two thirds of all US counties, two thirds of all US counties are disaster zone because it didn't rain. Crop fields look like this. We were within one year of global famine. Not many people know this, but the World Food Bank, have you guys heard of this? No. Was within one year of running out of food. Okay, international famine because it stopped raining in the United States of America. Australia this year, by the way, was on fire. Okay, the next year it rained. And look what happened, it flooded. Remember the Colorado floods? So if it doesn't rain, we lose crops and people starve. And when it finally does rain, people drown. Does it seem like a functional system? No. no. Not at all. Hurricane Sandy, you guys remember this one? Everybody should remember this one. We're getting more intense, more intense precipitation. We're getting crazy storms. And if our, if our soils can't handle it, we get things like erosion, eutrophication. Did you guys remember Hurricane Irene? Did you guys see the satellite imagery? Connecticut River? Billowing out brown sediment into Long Island Sound after that. Vermont exported hundreds of tons, hundreds of thousands of tons of soil down the river because the soil just didn't hold together because it rained so much. Okay? If the soil doesn't hold together and it washes off, we've lost. We've lost. Okay? And then this is a picture of a grass field with a gully in it. And the reason I have this picture here is it, it, we have to remind ourselves, just because it's green doesn't mean it's green, okay? If the soil's not functioning, if we're collecting too much water in an area, if we're doing whatever it happens to be, it still can break. Turf, overgrazed pasture, etc. Why do I care? That's my little girl. That's why I care. She should grow up in a world that has food that's healthy. Okay, this is my backyard garden. How many people are permaculturists? Anybody? A few? A permaculture theme homestead at my place. You can see the diversity in the landscape. We see no bare soil, we see tons of food growing, and we get harvest after harvest after harvest, and she's learning how to do this. I'm doing this for her and myself. Because our children need to grow up in a world that has abundant food, that has clean air, clean water, what happened.